the vows. Dustin, do you promise in the presence of God in the gathering of this family and friends to seek to be all Christ wants you to be, to lead your wife in her spiritual walk, to give more than you give, to dedicate your home and the raising of any children to the glory of God? And do you commit to your best always to honor God? Do you so promise? I do. Chelsea, do you promise in the presence of God and the gathering of family and friends to seek to be all Christ wants you to be, to encourage Dustin in his spiritual walk, to give more than you get, to dedicate your home, the raising of any children to the glory of God, and do you commit to your best always to honor God? Do you so promise? Dustin, you need to repeat after me. Okay. I, Dustin, I, Dustin, take you, Chelsea, take you, Chelsea, to be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. I, I accept you as God's gift to me. I accept you as God's gift. I love you with a love only Christ Himself can place within my heart. I will have and hold you. I will have and hold you from this day forward, from this day forward, for better or worse. In times of plenty or poverty, in times of plenty or poverty, in sickness and in health, I will love you. I will celebrate joy and sorrow with you. I will be faithful to you, to you alone, till death are we parted, according to our Father's holy ordinance. Chelsea. Repeat after me. I, Chelsea, take you, Dustin, to be my wedded husband. I accept you as God's gift to me. I love you with a love only Christ himself could place within my heart. I will have and hold you from this day forward, for better or worse, in times of plenty or poverty, in sickness and in health, I will love you. I will celebrate joy and sorrow with you. I will be faithful to you and to you alone till in death we are parted, according to our Father's holy order. Can I have the rings, please? These rings are a symbol of your commitment to love. They are made of gold, expressing the purity which should always be in your marriage. They are formed in never-ending circles. There is no separation point in them. They express the unending dimension of your love and external love of God. Share these rings now. In the full awareness of Christ's love and the eternal love of God. Dustin, be placed the ring on Chelsea's ring and repeat after me. Then Chelsea, with this ring, Chelsea, with this ring, I thee wed, I thee wed, I give this as a visible token of my love, I give this as a visible token of my love, and devotion. And, and I give it to you as I give my own life. And I give it to you as I give my own life. Chelsea, would you place the ring on Dustin's finger? Repeat after me. <laughs> Dustin, with this ring, I thee wed. I give this as a visible token of my love and devotion. And I give it to you as I give my own life. Now, after having pledged your love of loyalty to each other, 
and having sealed the pledge with the rings, I do by the authority vested in me and in in, by God's power through the ordinance of the church and the laws of our state, I pronounce you husband and wife. <laughs> you and Chelsea are no longer two independent people. You are now one in the eyes of the Lord. What God has joined, let no man put asunder. Dustin, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Great privileges that I have getting to do these these weddings like this is I am the first.